Hello, we are talk about uh, colors again and today I will show you how to use random colors function. We'll go to uh, that data named functions again, import function, search for colors. and find our sample file called uh, lambda colors unity copy it, this sample file first and i'll install all functions import all and i wanted to show you a random uh, function which produces random hex codes uh, we'll type equal sign and start typing rand to find and i need a random hack uh, colors and how many okay let it be 20 now I have a random hex color codes and uh, a next function like next step is a random a random colors print rand again and find a random colors function and let us use 20 random colors also so now you have some random colors they are not very beautiful because they are randomly represented it's not like a color palette and i'll think about it i'll think about how color palettes are created and maybe uh, sometime later i'll create something like color palette function which will create beautiful color uh, color uh, colors which which looks beautiful one with another these are, are just uh, random colors but sometimes you just need uh, fast uh, random color uh, for your work and you don't need to bother with some beauty beauty and uh, then these random colors are, are just fine you can make this cell looks like a square so it will be uh, like it will look more beautiful for you and next I want to show you how I created this function random hex colors without showing you the definition you see that my fun functions were uh, successfully imported so I can see them and I can read definition of random hex colors uh, when I click edit I see the definition and so forth what I want to show you uh, without technical details how it works and what stands behind it for this I found this beautiful picture which shows uh, how, uh, how how this RGB code what it stands for it that stands for R, R is red G is green and B is blue so RGB is a red green blue representation of any color on your screen why these colors why red green and blue this is uh, because our screens are made of light so this red green and blue are not paints uh, if you mix paint if you mix yellow and red paint you get you got orange color but with lights uh, it works in another way because uh, uh, lights uh, are uh, uh, made of uh, spectrum and uh, they are made of different uh, colors on this spectrum so you will have something like red next in the middle green and on the end you will get blue so if you mix all them and you give maximum of red green and blue you will get white color if you get zero red zero green and zero blue you will get black color uh, why is that because if no light then you have dark color if light is maximum then you get white color and everything in between is all colors we see on our screens so is it is beautiful and we have a range of each of them so this is a number and this is a number and this is a number but they are represented in hex code why this hex code is used because hex code lets us shorten this number up to two digits because hex has 16 as base of of this number and our decimal uh, numbers are have base 10 this why if you have greater base then your uh, numbers will use also letters from a uh, through a b c d e f from a to f because this gives us five six sorry six uh, uh, chars plus 10 numbers 10 digits from 0 to 9 will give us this hex code so this is a number between 0 and 
255 because we have uh, 256 colors in common but zero is one of them and so the ne the last is 255 and I can create any color in my spreadsheet uh, let's suppose I have zero and 255 as borders and I want to get uh, some number uh, for red some number for green and some number for blue I will just use rand between function rand sorry rand bit rand misspell it rand between it's like built-in function with low zero uh, I'll just type it uh, was low zero and 20 uh, 255 as a maximum so we've got three of them one of them is red this is green and this is blue so now we have this hex uh, numbers but they are in decimal way we need to convert it and there is also built-in function which called deck deck to hex you see converts decimal numbers uh, uh, sorry these to hexadecimal so we have hexadecimal uh, and we got this number and also uh, significant digits there are two of them so we want uh, to represent it with two digits now we have our hex code and if I add this uh, this number chart at the beginning and then add these plus these and plus these I'll get some random color uh, and uh, th that's it that this is some random color random color and you see now it of digits only but sometimes you will have on also numbers and if I use colors function it's also my named function it converts hex cut to actual color you will see what it is so now if I add something like a checkbox I'll insert a checkbox here and every time I click it I'll get some different random uh, color here and it's just made on the fly as you see we just generated this hex code but it is random so the same logic was behind my function but it generated multiple hex codes and next I converted this with uh, my colors uh, function uh, into, into this color in your cell if you're curious Please go inside colors function and also see definition how it was made. It is a beautiful trick and I hope you will like it.